United States of Senator John McCain. The senator and Republican presidential candidate died August 25th in Arizona. This hero of the Vietnam War, independent and maverick, was popular but also attracted the hostility of the hardliners of the Republican camp. Arizona Republican Senator John McCain and a former 2008 U.S. presidential candidate died August 25 in Arizona at 4.28 p.m. local time. The senator, who had brain cancer, decided to end his treatment, his family said on Friday. John Sidney McCain III was born August 29, 1936 on the American military base of Coco Solo, in the zone of the Channel of Panama then under American control. He comes from a military family, his father was Admiral. His youth is marked by changes in his father's assignment, causing him to attend many schools. After high school, he joined the Naval Academy in Annapolis, Maryland State in 1954 as his father and grandfather. He came out in the last places in 1958 after a hectic schooling. Military pilot, he is first instructor in the Navy and performs missions in the Mediterranean Sea and in the Atlantic. In 1965, he married Carol Shep, a former model. Then he was sent to Vietnam where he escaped death in a fire on July 29, 1967, on the aircraft carrier USS Forrestal. During his 24th mission, his plane was shot down on October 26, 1967, over Hanoi. He is taken prisoner by the North Vietnamese. Tortured several times, he was not released until 1973. Campaign of Slander In 2000, McCain is a candidate for the Republican nomination for the presidential election. But quickly George W. Bush is needed, McCain is the victim of an intense campaign of slander. And Bush is elected to the presidency of the country. In the Senate, McCain manages to get past with Democratic Senator Russ Feingold in 2002 a reform of campaign financing. He proves this occasion, as in others, he does pass the public interest before partisan interests, which earned him the hostility of some Republicans, especially on the right. A supporter of American interventionism in the world, he supports the invasion of Iraq in 2003 even though he contests the strategy developed by the Secretary of Defense, Donald Rumsfeld. He had approved the bombing of Serbia during the Kosovo War under the Clinton presidency in 1999. In the 2004 presidential election, he supports George W. Bush. The latter is re-elected for a final term. Also in 2008, the way is open for a second application. But his age, 71 years, is a handicap against the Democratic candidate, Barack Obama, 48 years old. He chooses right-wing Sarah Palin, the face of the Tea Party, a protest movement opposed to the federal state, as co-leader, but is largely beaten by Obama. In 2016, during the presidential campaign, he expresses his criticism of Republican candidate Donald Trump. He will become one of the most critical Republicans of the new president.
In particular, in November 2016, he denounced Trump's ambiguous comments on the use of torture. His intervention prevents, in July 2017, the repeal of Obamacare, the reform of the U.S. health system wanted by Obama. On a personal level, McCain's health is deteriorating and he is being treated from July 2017 for a very aggressive brain cancer. He published in May 2018 new memoirs, The Restless Wave Simon Schuster, untranslated, which concern the period following 2008, where he is still as critical of Trump. McCain leaves the image of a committed politician, defending the general interest in his beliefs, including sometimes against his own side, which has earned him a high popularity.